Okay, firstly I wanna start off by saying, that I don't stand by what I say in this video. This is just an opinion, and what I think. This is not facts, and I don't think this is 100% true. But anyways enjoy, and let's move further. So when I see K-tubers doing unpopular K-pop opinions videos, I see a lot of K-tubers having the same recycled opinions that plenty of other channels do as well, like for example, standing an underrated group doesn't make you quirky or cool, Lisa isn't the best dancer in K-pop, it's okay to not stand a group because of its fandom, and many more opinions that get recycled and resurface again and again with no actual originality in K-tube opinions. I think one reason behind the opinions being the same a lot of the time amongst K-tubers, is because most K-tubers, don't have a full grasp on the K-pop industry and the many different K-pop groups and soloists that are there in the industry, and that most people only listen to bigger company groups, or groups with better budgeting. So due to the lack of knowing different K-pop artists, people don't really have any new things to say on different K-pop artists, because a lot of the opinions they say, are probably already said before, because of the small portion of K-pop artists that most listen to, people say the same things that they see about a group or idol, and don't really say anything new. And if you look at me, with me knowing many different artists in K-pop and Korean music, I always end up seeing things differently sometimes, and then get more different opinions that are new and original. This video idea came out of me thinking about K-Tube and the recycled opinions. So as I said, the opinions of most K-Tubers being recycled and used again and again, could be because of the lack of knowing more artists, because knowing more artists in K-pop than your average K-pop fan, it leads you to think more about K-pop. And yes it does. Ever since I got into smaller groups and started knowing about different groups, I've been starting to have different opinions. Some good, some bad and some ugly. But nonetheless, they were, are different, and new. People should view K-pop in a different light. Like for me, ever since I got fully immersed into K-pop, by getting exposed to new things in K-pop that I never knew about, I've started to have more different opinions. I've started to see things differently, and it has made me think on different things in K-pop. On different big and small artists, groups, made me think on K-tubers, and yes, K-pop has made me think on K-tubers, and made me think on things, that has led me to have new opinions. Like for example, how I keep ranting about, how MVs don't matter and that you should appreciate the song more. I've been saying this a lot on my channel, and it's because of the fact that I got fully immersed into smaller groups, and have seen people hating on MBs for being low budgeted, because of the company being small, and because of this, I've started to continuously rant about MBs don't matter, and every time I rant, I always say new things about how MBs shouldn't matter. And this opinion started, because of me getting sucked into smaller groups. So for people to have new opinions, I think it's better for them to know more artists, and view K-pop in a different light. Because seeing things differently or knowing more about different artists in K-pop, can lead you to have new original opinions. Whether it's just an opinion on how this artist has amazing dance, vocals, rap or whether it's an opinion that could be harsh. Nonetheless it brings more originality to your opinions videos, and brand new opinions come into light, and not recycled old opinions, used by many. In conclusion, people can have original opinions, if they view K-pop differently and know about different K-pop artists. And because of this, old recycled opinions can be gone for good, if people just dug deep when it came to K-pop, and if people just opened their eyes more in K-pop, so that it leads them to think, and their thinking expands and their minds wander into K-pop, leading them to see things in K-pop, that gives them opinions, that nobody has talked about before. Then at least the unpopular K-pop opinions trend, will at least bring channels to give opinions that are interesting, instead of the same old opinions, that are as popular as Blackpink and BTS, and circulate through different K-tubers videos. <laughs>